Well, Mid Journey is just over a year old and it's been a pretty freaking popular. I started back in March and as you can see, I almost have 6,000 jobs. So when you have this many jobs, it can get pretty crazy with finding some of your images that you might have prompted earlier and keeping up with those prompts. So I'm going to show you three ways that you can find your older images inside of Midjourney. So the first place is midjourney.com. Okay, midjourney.com. If you go to midjourney.com, log into your account, and you actually go to your portfolio, okay, if you look right up here at the top, you see archive. And when you click archive, okay, it's going to give you your images based on the month that you created them. Now, it's showing you your grid okay and your upscales and so I can go all the way back to let's just say March and if you hover over you can actually see the dates shift and change so I'm just gonna click April 13th okay and so a lot of times I can look at this and say oh I created this before this or this was earlier or I created this back in whenever okay so this is where I can look and say okay I created these a while back okay so I'm gonna take this because sometimes I, I can't find them I just simply can't find them so I'm gonna choose this one right here and this is the way number three that you can find you can move it to discord so that you can see it okay so once you find it here it's like you can open it in discord okay open in discord or you can open it in a new tab but I kind of want to bring this into my current workflow so if you click open it in discord we'll just do that so you can see it opens it in the web version of discord now this may take a few minutes because it has to talk to the server or whatever um, it's coming give it a few seconds to log in okay here we go okay and so now you can see where it is inside the discord server now um, I'm not going to take the time to watch it populate here's another way let's just say I'm working on something currently and I want to bring this in okay I want to go in and click copy job ID okay I want to copy my job ID and I have the Discord app loaded, but I'm gonna do this on the web-based Discord. I'm gonna come here to my server, and I might wanna bring this in to a different channel so that I can work from here, okay? So, if you hit forward slash, okay, and click show, it's going to ask you for the job ID, so I'm going to just go ahead and paste that in and hit enter. Okay, now this is a, a plug-in extension that I will tell you a little bit about probably at the end, but let me turn it off for now so that it's not distracting. Okay, and it brings the job including the prompt and everything right here into my current thread. Okay, so that's number two. That's the number two way that you can find old jobs, bring them over. Okay, so way number one was to just look through the archives in the Mid Journey account. Way number two is when you click on it, you can actually open it inside of Discord. So when I click on this, click the three dots, and I can put open in. Discord, okay, and then if I actually want to put it um, into where I'm currently working, I can go and do forward slash show and put the job ID in, all right, and then the third one is I'll, it's my favorite cheat, okay, so let's just say I can't see it, I don't have the time to look through this, a quicker way to kind of search 
is for me to just click search right up here to the right. Look right up here, you can see search. So if I click search, okay, and I can put in a coloring page, okay? What it's going to do is go back and show me 176 results for my coloring pages because I clicked from user, okay? If I click old, it'll start bringing up some of the older things. So this was back in June, some of the coloring pages I created. And so let's just say I find something that I want. I wanted this lady right here. I click jump right here and it actually jumps to wherever this is. This is how I can go ahead and find what I've been looking for. So I can copy this. I can um, try to open it in the web to get the, um, to open it in, in Discord. I'm um, excuse me, not Discord. Uh, Mid Journey, right? Because now I have the date. I can go back to that archive and look, okay, June 18th. If I go back and look at June 18th. Okay, so this is June 18th, and here we go. Now I can go and find it. I can actually go through and copy the job ID if I want to, and bring it up to the present or whatever. All right, so hopefully that makes sense. And then if I wanna go back to the bottom, because this is way up in June and we're in August now, I can click jump to present, and it brings me to what I'm currently working on inside of this coloring book thread okay all right so again one more time the three ways that you can do it one you can look at the archive where you can find the dates number two you can click open in discord the three dots here click click open in discord okay or you can also copy the job ID to bring it to where you're currently working. And last but not least, you can do the search by clicking search from user, because you're the user, right? And click in any kind of keyword that you might have used in your prompt, all right? Well, whoops. I almost forgot to tell you about the plugin, okay? And so the plugin is called Prompt a Lot, and it's by Chris, Christian um, Hedorn, I think is his name, how you pronounce that last name. But basically, it's a Google Chrome plugin, and it gives you shortcuts to do things like download, copy your prompts, uh, upscale. It gives you all of these uh, aspects, including some statistics about like how fast the mid-journey models are running, things like that. Uh, you go to promptalot.com, and it even has a way that you can save your prompts in a library. However, rather than spending time with me trying to explain to you all the wonderful things that this does, I'm going to link Christian's video below and um, then you can check out the Prompt A Lot plugin for yourself. Trust me, it's a game changer. It'll save you. Uh, it'll make things about 10 times faster in mid journey. All right, catch you on the flip side.